parents, I want to encourage you today that Easter is a special holiday full of a lot of traditions that might be a little different this year. And that's okay. It's okay to talk about the real meaning behind Easter, why we get to celebrate, not just what we celebrate. Sometimes we get caught in the tradition over the purpose. So take this time that feels a little different and make sure you understand why we celebrate. Remember the cross that we celebrate is empty. Jesus won. He is victorious. Be sure to strike that balance between the two things of talking about the pain and suffering, but he didn't die so that we could suffer with him. He died so that we could live. Don't forget the hope when talking about the suffering. At the same time, don't just talk about the hope without remembering the suffering. The great sacrifice that Jesus gave is the purpose why we have hope even in today when we don't know what's happening. We know that our sins are forgiven. We know that if we ask Jesus to be in charge of everything, he already is. And we get to see him lead us through these things. I'm praying for you and your family. Continue to ask questions to see where your kids are at. Continue to seek what they're actually asking instead of just guessing or assuming. This quieter time, this stiller time may seem like a different pace. Take that opportunity to talk to your kids in depth. Take the opportunity to look in the Bible together, to find the answers together. It's okay to say those three words, I don't know. It's also okay to say, let's find out together. Discovery and teaching is so important. You are their guide. Teach them things that can last more than just today. Teach them things that can last for a lifetime, even when you're not there to help answer it. <laughs>